Well, good afternoon, everybody. Um, this is a follow up video to my original video with regards to the Q problem on the VMS4. In that situation, when you had the virtual DJ software loaded, Q3 and 4 would light simultaneously, and you would require extra key presses to get the Q to work when in, in conjunction with the software. Now, in front of you, you will see the VMS4 with all all four Q lights turned off, but at the same time, you'll see that I have VDJ loaded and pressing of the Q buttons works as you would expect. However, I wouldn't be making this video unless there was something else to report. And I will try to explain now while loading tracks within Virtual DJ. So, as most DJs do, I have Virtual DJ with the auto headphones uh, switched onto always, which means that when you load a deck onto either deck, a track onto either deck, the headphones should automatically switch to that deck. So if I load one of my tracks here onto deck one, you see the track loaded. Well, actually, it's gone onto the onto the right deck. You see the tracks loaded. But if we go back down to the VMS4, you will see that no Q light has come on. However, with the Q turned up and the Q turned on, if I press play, we do get volume as you would expect. So that's working properly. However, the Q light did not come on. So let's just stop that track. Now, as I load a second track, so this will go onto the other deck. Right, just load this track here. You'll see the deck's loaded. As far as Virtual DJ is concerned, the queuing has switched to the left deck. If I go back to the VMS4, you'll see that once again, no queue light has been enabled. However, if I press play, and turn the queue on, the queue is working properly. I can press play on both, and I can switch between them without any adverse effects on here. Let's stop those playing now. The other issue, of course, is with Virtual DJ. When you select the deck in Virtual DJ, the Q light brings that deck to the foreground, as you can see there. So if I switch between decks, the decks come into the foreground. However, this is not being represented properly with the Q buttons. If I come back down to the VMS4 and hit deck one, as you can see, it has the focus has been set to that deck and is now in the foreground. If I hit the Q on deck two, it's brought that to the foreground. And as you'd expect, both lights are on. If I now turn the queue off on deck one, it's brought deck one back to the foreground in Virtual DJ. Press deck two, both are queued off, but focus has been set back onto the right deck or deck two in Virtual DJ. So the expected behavior isn't as what you'd expect when Virtual DJ is connected, if you press this queue, it should come on, but when you press this Q, this one should automatically toggle off because focus has been set to the other deck, so it should go like that. Again, when you click this one, that should go off, and that one should come on, and pressing between the two should toggle between the two decks as it would do visually, as you can see here. The issue, of course, is that you either have both decks queued on or both decks queued off as you go through it's not a toggle it's still the two-way switch i hope this makes sense um, this deals with the update to the queue problem uh, all comments and feedback of course um, gladly appreciated and let's see if we can get this one resolved as quickly as american dj did with the first one thank you